Hi everyone, thanks so much for watching today. I have another project pan I'm starting, and this is going to be a collab with three ladies that I enjoy watching here on YouTube. They're inspirational, they're channels that I enjoy watching, so I definitely wanna encourage you to go and check them out. I have Amber, Bethany, and Emily doing this project pan. We are picking six high-end makeup products and trying to use those up by Christmas. So I'm gonna get started and show you the products and I'm gonna start with the one that I'm actually not able to show progress on. This is the Stila Smudge Stick Waterproof Eyeliner in Damsel and I really like this eyeliner. I'm wearing it today. I feel like it just glides on very well and I can't crank it up or click it up because it won't go back down. So I do wanna use this. This is an older product that's been in my collection for a while. It's still good and I still really enjoy it but I feel like I need to use it before it goes bad. It just glides on so beautifully. It's very rich, very pigmented, and I know that I'll enjoy using that. And I won't have a way to show any progress for you guys, but I will be using this, try to use it every single day. The next product I have is a lip product. It's the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Lip Pencil in Midnight Cowboy. And I really like this lip liner. And this is where it's uh, matching up, I guess, for progress sake. And I like to not include the little bottom part because I won't be able to sharpen it past that point. So that's where I am right now. Oops, sorry. That's where I am right now. I will try to deepen up the lines here so that you can see. I'll use, I'll go over it with a sharpie so you can see a little bit better where I am for the intro. But I enjoy this a lot. I'll show you a swatch. It's very creamy. It, again, this is an older product in my collection, so I want to use it before it goes bad. And I love this color. I think it's gonna be perfect for fall. This next product is gonna be a little bit of a challenge because the color is very deep. And if you wanna join me and pick a deeper lipstick color, that would be super cool. Let me know what uh, lipstick color you're choosing to try to pan by Christmas down in the comments. But this is the Lancome Rouge and Love lipstick and it's in number 275. It's super pretty. I should have worn it today. I just... I like this berry color that I'm wearing on my lips too, and I felt like I only have a couple more days because I'm gonna have, I'm gonna be wearing this a lot. But this is the Rouge and Love, and I do have a line here on this paper for where I'm beginning, and that's for the start of this project. Also, please join in with us for this project pan. I think it's a really fun, kind of smaller project pan. I've noticed for myself, I enjoy the smaller project pans a little bit better than the larger ones. So please join with us, and if you're not on YouTube and you don't want to make a video or not on Instagram, uh, you just want to join in, I'd love to know what six products you're going to select to try to use up. This next one, I'm not gonna try to use up completely, but I wanna try to hit pan, and it's a bronzer, and I usually don't put blushes or bronzers or highlights in my project pans, but I'm going for the gold on this one. <laughs> this is the Laura Mercier Matte Radiance Baked Powder in Bronze 03, and I think that I'll be able to do a good job hitting pan because I feel like there isn't a whole lot of product in here. This is just a little deluxe sample, but I've been using this for at least over a year, and I still haven't hit, hit pan on it but I like the way that it looks and I think it would be a great project pan item. So I'll give you a little swatch. You can see I am wearing it today, but there's a swatch of the bronzer right there. My last item that I have, ooh, actually I have two more. I have the Chanel Stilo Eyeshadow in 107. This is the Fresh Effect Eyeshadow and it's a very pretty purple color. I'll use this for layering my eyeshadows. I don't like to use it alone because I feel like it creases on me, but if I layer a shadow on top, I like the effect of that. So that's the Stilo Eyeshadow in number 107. My last product here is a powder, and I'm going to be working on the Becca. This is the Mineral Powder, Perfect Skin Mineral Powder in Sand. I've already hit pan on this, so I'm going to try to use this up completely. Also, I know in the past I've had requests for doing a repressing my powder, how I repress my powder, so hopefully I'll be able to put that video in uh, because this is the next powder that's the closest to being used up and needing repressing. So this is the powder that I'm going to be working on using up. Uh, before Christmas. I hope you enjoyed seeing these items. I'll also insert pictures for these two products throughout my project pan update so you can see where I was. The only one, again, I won't be able to show progress on is the Stila eyeliner, but I will be working on it and try to use it up. 
Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know if you're joining in with us down below in the comments. And also please check out Emily, Amber, and Bethany's channels. I'll put links down in the description area. Have a wonderful day, everyone, and have a wonderful week. Bye. Mm -hmm.